Learn this. Four ways of publishing PowerPoint presentations online. Zillions of PowerPoint presentation are built every day and then presented live in a meeting, conference, classroom, or on the web. But what happens next? Do you share your presentation? You build your presentations upon your knowledge to get a message across. Is your live audience enough? Or is there a larger potential in your message? By publishing your presentation online you have the opportunity to reach a much larger audience, including new usages of your presentation that you could not start to imagine. By publishing presentations online, you also allow your audience to choose when, and where, to enjoy your presentation. But how do you publish your presentation online? What are the choices and the parameters at your disposal? In this video we will show four different strategies for publishing your presentations online, explaining benefits and drawbacks for each strategy, and also providing examples of online services that may help you in publishing your presentation. Strategy 1. Just put the slides online. For example, slideshare.net. Just putting the slides online is very easy. You only need to upload your PowerPoint file to a website. But the presentation will be silent, and the added value of your comments is lost. This strategy may be a good solution for text-intensive presentations that do not need explanations. Strategy 2. Add your voice. For example by using services like MyBrainShark.com. The main advantage of this strategy is that you can add your comments and explanations. The main drawback is that recording is difficult. This strategy is best suited if you have access to proper recording equipment, a good voice, and good language skills. Strategy 3. Add a voiceover. For example using services like Voice123.com, helping you in finding voice talents for the voiceover. The main advantage is that you get a professional voiceover. The drawback is that this strategy is more expensive in terms of time and money. Strategy 4. Add text to speech. For example using services like SlideTalk.net. The main advantages are that it is easy to publish with this strategy, since you only need to type text to get your comments spoken, and that you have access to many voices in many languages. The drawback is that text-to-speech has less flexibility than human voices. By listening to the voices in this video, which are all text-to-speech, you can get an idea of the quality level that can be achieved. Let's summarize what we just learned. Strategy 1. Just put the slides online. Good solution for text-intensive presentations that do not need explanations. Strategy 2. Add your voice. Good solution if you have adequate recording and vocal skills. Strategy 3. Add a voiceover. Good solution if you have time and money to hire and manage a professional voice talent. Strategy 4. Add text to speech. Good solution to add your comments in an easy way without need of recording your voice or hiring a voice talent. You watched 4 Ways of Publishing PowerPoint Presentations Online. Brought to you by SlideTalk.net.